Imagine you're riding a bike and you suddenly fall. You hit the ground, but thanks to your helmet, you get up without a scratch. That's because protective equipment is designed to absorb forces and keep us safe. Just like how buildings, bridges, and even animals protect themselves from forces. Whether it's a helmet, seatbelt, or even the padding in your shoes, all protective gear is made to reduce impact, spread out force, or block harmful effects. A helmet is one of the most important pieces of protective equipment. It works the same way as a turtle's shell. When something hits it, the hard outer layer spreads out the force, so it doesn't focus on one spot. Inside, soft padding absorbs the impact to protect your head. That's why helmets are used in sports like football and hockey, and for activities like biking and skateboarding. Without them, even a small hit could cause serious injury. Seatbelts in cars work differently. Instead of stopping you all at once, they slow you down gradually during a crash. Imagine running full speed into a wall. It would hurt, right? Now imagine if someone gently pulled you back before you hit the wall. That's what seatbelts do. They spread the stopping force across your chest and lap instead of letting all the impact hit your body at once. Think about the padding in your shoes. Every time you walk, run, or jump, your feet hit the ground with force. If there was no padding, your feet would feel every single impact. But soft, flexible materials in the soles absorb the shock so your feet don't get sore. The same idea is used in knee pads, elbow pads, and even the mats in gymnastics, all designed to absorb force and reduce injury. Some protective equipment is made to block forces instead of absorbing them. Gloves, goggles, and fire-resistant clothing protect against heat, sharp objects, and chemicals. A firefighter's suit blocks extreme heat so they can move safely through fire. A construction worker's hard hat protects against falling objects by spreading out the impact instead of letting it hit one small area. Every day, protective equipment keeps people safe by reducing force, spreading out impact, or blocking danger. Helmets, seatbelts, padding, and safety gear all work the same way, to protect the body from harmful forces. The next time you put on a helmet, buckle your seatbelt, or wear gloves in the cold, remember, you're using the same kind of force protection that engineers build into skyscrapers, bridges, and even nature itself.